So guys, for the first step, you wanna get into this screen. Now to get here, you wanna turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. As it's turning on, you wanna quickly turn it back off again and then turn it back on again. You wanna repeat this three times. So you wanna turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. As it's turning on, you wanna quickly turn it back off again and then turn it back on again. Repeat this three times, it will then take you into this screen. It's gonna say that your PC did not start correctly, you wanna click on advanced options. And now once we're here, I'm gonna be showing you four different ways on how we can fix this problem. So for the first method, you wanna click on troubleshoot, and then advanced options, and then start to prepare. If you do not see start to prepare, then you wanna select CM recovery options. Then it should appear right here. So you wanna click on start to prepare, and it's now gonna start diagnosing your PC, see if this works for you. If that did not work, we're gonna click on advanced options. And now for the second method, you wanna click on troubleshoot, advanced options again, and then we're gonna go with system restore. If you have a restore point enabled on your computer, then you wanna click on next, and then go back to your restore point. Hopefully this will now fix your problem. If you do not have a restore point, that's fine. We're gonna click on cancel. And now for the next method, you wanna click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then start up settings. And then click on restart. And now once we're here, you wanna enable safe mode. So you wanna click on either four or F4 on your keyboard. So click on four or F4, wait for this to load. And it's now gonna take us into safe mode. Now you just wanna restart your computer. And then hopefully that will now fix your problem. If that did not work, then you wanna come back to this screen like I show you how to do at the start of the video. Now you wanna click on troubleshoot, advanced options, and then command prompt. And then once you're on this, you wanna type in SFC space forward slash scan now, and then click on enter. Then you want to run this scan. And then once you've done that, now we're gonna type in chkdsk space forward slash f space, and now your Windows drive letter. For me, it's gonna be C colon. For you, it's also most likely gonna be C colon. However, if it's something else, you wanna type in your drive letter with a colon, and then click on enter. And now you just wanna run this scan. It's gonna take a while, but now once you complete the scan, wait for it to be fully completed, then you want to close out of this. Now you just want to continue to Windows, see if that works for you. If that did not work for you, you want to come back to this screen, then you want to click on troubleshoot, and then reset this PC. If your files are not backed up, then you want to go with keep my files. If they are backed up, then you want to go with remove everything. Then you want to reset your computer, and then hopefully that will now fix your problem. 